So here we have a question where we need to work out this area of the shaded region but we haven't been given any angle okay so the first thing is we need to find out what this angle is I'm going to call that theta now some of you are thinking how can we work out and we've been told that the length from A to B is 12 well this length here is the radius so if that's 7 this must also be 7 because that's the radius now what you've been given here which some of you lot didn't manage to work out unfortunately you got seven centimeters there you got seven centimeters there and you got 12 centimeters there and I need to find this angle now that's your typical cosine rule Shh. so that's your cosine rule now only one person managed to figure that one out so we need to make sure we get that sorted so if I call that angle capital A this is the side A I will say 12 well we know that the formula for cosine rule is cos of a is equal to b squared plus c squared minus a squared all shared by 2bc bc being the sides that make the angle okay bc being the sides that make the angle a so first of all to get cos I'm going to call that angle theta I'm going to use 7 squared plus 7 squared subtract 12 squared which is the opposite side shared by 2 times 7 times 7 so you get cos theta now if I do that um, I'm going to put it in the bracket 7 squared plus 7 squared minus 12 squared all over 2 times 7 times 7 you will get a negative number which is minus 0.469 now don't worry about that negative number because when I take the cos over don't forget I'm going to press shift to to make it come over so whenever we get in this we press shift so that gives me cos inverse of 0.469 so theta will give me so if cos answer I'll get 117 well actually I get 17.99 so I'm going to call that 118 degrees now now mandem this angle is 118 degrees so first of all I'm going to work out like we did before the area of the sector area of sector one minute now area of sector is just simply 118 over the full circle 360 times pi r squared pi times r squared is 7 r is radius so if you put that into your calculator you'll get uh, just give me one second 118 over 360 multiplied by pi times 7 squared equals you'll get 50.46 I'm going to call that then you get the area of the triangle area of triangle and in this case is this triangle we got which is going to be half times 7 times 7 times sine the angle between them is 118 so here you're going to get uh, 0.5 times 49 times sine 118 and you'll get 21.63 now to get this shaded region you subtract those which is called the segment And you'll get uh, subtract that from 50.46 and you should have got the area of I'm gonna call this to freezing and figures 28.8 and I'm gonna call that centimeter squared 